Shout out to Media Takeout for posting this story on November 9th, the 2018 title, Atlanta Housewife Portia Pays All Bills, Fiance List for Free, Details. And they posted a picture <laughs> of the two of them and it says Gold Digger on it. <laughs> I guess calling him the Gold Digger. Here's a media takeout role. Atlanta housewife Portia Williams is paying for all of the household expenses as her new fiance Dennis McKinley lives off her for free. Media takeout news has confirmed. Portia Williams fiance Dennis McKinley now officially resides in her home. The Atlanta businessman moved into her Atlanta mansion this summer and he just put up his home for sale. And that's not all. A little birdie told us that Portia and Dennis have agreed that she pay 100% of the household expenses until Dennis sells his apartment. It's not clear how they intend to split the expenses afterwards. The entrepreneur who is originally from Detroit listed his Atlanta condo for sale at a price of $495,000, which is reasonable for the market. The condo is a 2,500 square foot loft with three stories, two bedrooms, two bathrooms and 20 foot ceilings and the apartment which is inside a converted warehouse has a very modern and open look and then they posted some pictures of it i don't know if, not, if i can share those here but anyways i guess i'll end up posting them on my blog uh, the kitchen features quartz countertops and thermidor and bosch appliances in other Derek news, Portia's co-star Candy Burris appears on E's Daily Pop Monday to chat about the tea she's got on Dennis McKinley, and it's not looking good for Williams, who is now engaged to and expecting a baby with McKinley. Quote, I knew some people that he had also dated or whatever, and some of the timelines were overlapping, Burris says on the November 5th show. Quote, and it was a few things that I just kind of felt like at the time she should know seeing as though they had a new relationship but the weird part was she and I were in it were in this place where we were trying to make things right and it's kind of weird to bring information they don't want to hear when we were trying to fix our relationship in quote Burris acknowledged that it's typical for the ladies of the real housewives to discuss one another's new bows and McKinley was no different listen y'all do you think this fool is a male heifer? Do you think he's out here playing my bae? My goddess Portia Almighty Williams Christ? Y'all know that I pray <laughs> to Portia. Y'all know that Portia is... I mean, Portia is my everything, my lord. So to hear this foolishness is like, it hurts my heart. Then again, everything hurts my heart. I'm three feet tall, 555 pounds. <sighs> Anyways, guys, I got to go. Do you think he's out here playing Porsche or what? Let me know what you think about it all below. Meet Magazine on YouTube, Twitter, and Facebook. Meet Magazine blog and Instagram. Thumbs up, comment, subscribe, notify. Share this video on social media, Twitter, Facebook, Google Plus, two cans with a string in the middle telepathically. That way everybody and their mama too knows, allegedly, Mr. McKinley is out here just philandering and being a male heifer. Now here's the thing. <clears throat> Excuse me. I know a lot of y'all are like me. You know that you wish... Uh, Nothing but bad stuff on their relationship because, you know, everybody knows that I'm in love with Portia. But here's the thing, though. The truth of the matter is this. That is Portia's man, and I'm honestly happy for them, and I'm wishing them the best. You know, she's way out of my league, and, you know, I, I mean, she's everything. She deserves the best. So if she's happy with this guy, then I'm happy for them, okay? I don't wish anything bad. I hope that the bad is there's, there keep. It's like everybody keeps saying crazy stuff about this fool. It's like every time I hear his name, it's yet another person saying something negative about him. So I, I, I just hope that the stuff that people are saying is just not true. Oh, that people are just being some damn haters because it, it's not. Look, guys, it, literally, I, I haven't heard anybody come out and say anything positive yet at all. But anyways, let me know what you think about it below. Me Magazine on YouTube, Twitter and Facebook. Meet Magazine blog on Instagram. Thumbs up, comment, subscribe, notify. Do you believe these bad things that are being said about this man? Or do you think it's just a bunch of foolishness? Let me know what you think about it below. Meet Magazine.